Hello. His name is Leo and he has moved with his friends to an abandoned mansion. It's been a year and a half since the landlord kicked out the last tenant for not paying rent, and in that time the house has been abandoned, but people have broken in and completely trashed it. The police had to intervene. Still, they fell in love with the house as soon as they saw it and got it for well below its original cost. They have a lot of work. But his goal is to make this house shine again. Welcome to, Improving an Abandoned Mansion. Here we are, right at the point where the series began. Hello friends. How are you? Welcome back, I'm going to start a series I'm going to call, Improving an Abandoned Mansion, to turn it into a luxury mansion. How many chapters has this series given, I think there are about 30. And if we really analyze everything, because there is data that you do not know, I swear it is surprising, because from the outset this series, or well, these videos of, improving an abandoned mansion, they were not an idea worked on, organized and designed to last a long time, on the contrary, the first chapter was a totally improvised video, one that I didn't even know if it was going to work. I'm going to tell you what made me start renovating this house and what made it expand to a lot of chapters. Let's start. How did the series, Improving an Abandoned Mansion, start? For those of you who have been on this channel for a long time, you will know that I have uploaded any type of content, from sketches, musical parodies, Improving an Abandoned Mansion, challenges, blogs, and now I am uploading some incredible travel videos, which by the way I recommend because... They are not doing very well, but there is an incredible production behind them, and I recommend them to you. Anyway, I have uploaded all kinds of videos to this channel. In the middle of 2018, I had a boom in views thanks to the musical parodies I started to make, and they were the videos that worked the best. Which was what I did most. At the beginning of 2019 I moved into this house and I recorded some videos moving into this house, it's that simple. And then what happens, I had no idea what to upload, I had no idea. As I have told you, I was focused on musical parodies. But I had thought, like every YouTuber, to record a few videos showing the house, but what happens, there were two factors, two things that made me start the series of improving an abandoned mansion. The first was that one of my colleagues, I won't say who he is, but he was absolutely right. He told me, hey, Leo, don't show the whole house, leave a part of the house unshown, so that those of us who come next can also show it. So I stopped showing the house for a moment. So what was the second factor that made the seeds of improving a mansion germinate? An advertising campaign came to me, a brand contacted me to make an ad for a video game, a video game that I downloaded, that I started to play and I liked it, but the brand asked me to upload the video as soon as possible. So I was in a rather problematic situation. I didn't know what to record at home. I couldn't put advertising in a song I was doing at the time for two reasons. One, because it would take a lot of time to do the song. And second, how do you advertise a video game in a song? Yes. You can show it in the video clip, but I had to explain details and features of the game. Anyway, I had a problem because I didn't know in which video to put the ad for that brand. Then I remembered that one night. I stood up in front of the window of my room, which is that one up there, and I looked at the horizon. I looked down this little road, and I saw, what I saw every day, that this garden was a mess. That that fence was a mess and that everything was a mess, since when I moved into this house knowing how little we were going to pay and that I was going to stay here for a long time, I had thought about fixing it up a bit. So I asked myself, what if I record a video fixing a house? I have never done it in my life, I have never made a reform video, or DIY, or painting on my channel, I have always made made humorous videos, well, I am going to see if a video renovating a house works. And that's what I did, I had two weeks to make the first chapter of improving an abandoned mansion, which by the way, I chose the title minutes before posting the video. Initially, it was to be to improve a house. Horrible. Two weeks to create the idea, record it, edit it and deliver it to the brand to approve the video and thus be able to upload it. And you have to take into account three things, one, that I had never renovated or fixed a house. See how he paints. 
Two, I had never uploaded a video like this and I didn't know how to edit it. And three, I didn't know where to start with the renovation so I started with the easy part. In the first chapter one only painted some stairs and removed some dead vegetation to plant a new one. But I was so useless that I did it the other way around, first I painted the stairs and then I uprooted the plants, so I dirty all the stairs. And I had to repaint them. Once I had recorded the video, which by the way took me about two days, I had to edit it. I remember that I spent several days thinking about how I was going to edit it, did I make it funny, like a tutorial, adventure or epic. I remember that I was passing to my friends and my girlfriend all the versions that I did and in all of them they responded to me. Leo this video will not work for you. In the end, I edited it epically and took a chance to see how it would turn out. I said. I left it at that, I showed the final version of the video to all my friends and the response was again the same, but, at that moment I had a hunch and said, let's go ahead, this video will work, so I sent it to the brand for approval. In case you are not understanding, when a video is sponsored, when a YouTuber makes a video with a brand, before uploading it, he has to send it for approval, and then it can be published. Three days before I had to publish it, I sent it for approval and the brand liked the video enough to make their promo. I did not expect this answer, so very good. And what happened the next day, well, the video was a success, that is, something that nobody expected happened, the video worked and of course the promo went wonderfully. This video is sponsored by War Robots, and it will be collaborations like these that will make it possible for us to renovate this house and make it more beautiful. And of course seeing that it was going so well, seeing that so many people asked me to continue those videos, in fact there were people who even sent me emails asking me, please don't stop doing that. I mean, it was crazy, I would never have imagined this in my life. So good, I continued with the videos and I was like that up to 30 chapters. Now, why did I stop recording the series? Well, there are three reasons and all of them are related. The first time I started to get bored, everything you see was exhausting, which I was fixing later behind the cameras, I had to maintain it and take care of it and it was double work, in effect, everything became fixing an area that I later had to maintain. And of course, as the series progressed, the bigger the area that I fixed, the more things I had to maintain later and of course it took longer and longer to record videos, I felt very helpless, I couldn't keep all the gardens to then continue fixing another area that I had to maintain in the future, because of course, if I don't maintain what I've fixed, everything will get ugly again. The series began to consume a lot of time and stress. Although since it worked at that moment, there was no problem, more or less. The second, in each chapter one tried to do more, so that you would see more changes. In the beginning, there were many things to fix and few to maintain, so I could do everything, but when there were more things to maintain than fix, each time I was restoring and fixing fewer things of the chapters, because as I told you before, I could not with everything. So, this happened. Some people started commenting. You do less and less things. A video just for this? Of course, those people didn't know that before recording that, I had spent several hours maintaining another part of the house, and that's why I started to get a little disgusted with the series, because I put a lot of love and dedication to the house and I was beginning to receive criticism because I hadn't done enough in one episode. And the third and last reason why I finished recording the series, is that after many chapters, people, rightly, began to get tired and I had less and less visits and this made the series began to be not very profitable and I started to lose money. It makes me sad, because that series has given me a lot. Now. Why I'm leaving. Before you think I'm leaving for some strange reason, no. I'm not. I'm leaving this house because every two or three years I move, I like to move, and I'm overwhelmed to be always in the same place, so, for those of you who think that there has been some problem between partners, no, there hasn't, maybe there has been a different way of seeing life or how to run a house, but nothing more than that. Now it's time to talk about the sale of the house, did I sell it? The house was bought, the house was rented. I already answered this a long time ago, I don't remember, just in case, follow me on Instagram, so you don't miss anything. But don't worry, because I'll tell you again. The house is not bought, it is rented, so I quickly answer the question that you are surely asking yourself. Leo, then why were you so foolish to renovate a house that you rented? Simply, because the rent was very low, so that you understand me, 
Before coming to this house, before moving here, I was looking at other houses, some in the same area where I am right now and they cost between 3,500 and 4,000 euros per month. Well, you know how much this one costs, a little more than 2,000 euros, that is, I have paid a little more than 500 euros a month to be able to live here, so yes, the series was totally profitable for me, that is, I earned more money than what I really spent on the house, besides that I like to live in a well-kept house. I like a clean and beautiful house, so, in addition to being my job to record this series, we could say that it was my hobby. The house has been sold by the owners, and in a few months a new family will come to live here. My question is, do you want me to stop by here in the future to see if they will let me in, and I can see how the house is, that is, I have grown incredibly fond of the house and I would like to see that it is in good hands and that they are taking care of her at least as much as I do, which obviously isn't perfection either, you know I could have taken care of her so much better. Anyway, so far the series, 15,000 likes and I improved my new house, now I invite you to see one of my new series, Touring Spain, because you will not only discover beautiful places, but you will also be enjoying content with 100% quality, and nothing more to say, thanks for being here, thanks for watching the series from start to finish, even if you haven't really done it, thanks for the support and see you in photos and videos. Checkmate bitches.